Today, the first Friday of December, we celebrate the great feast of St. Nicholas, who was a bishop in Turkey who was known for his generosity to the poor and his love for children. And we see in him uh, the great model of a life given for Christ. Uh, today, St. Nick visits us and gives gifts in honor of uh, his great example of goodness and holiness. And we, we seek to imitate that as well. Tomorrow, I'm traveling to Rome uh, to spend a week there. Uh, we have our Ad Limina visit coming up. Ad Limina is Latin for to the thresholds. And in this case, it means to the threshold of the tombs of the apostles. So every bishop in the world, every five years, uh, goes to Rome to give a report on the status of his diocese to the Holy See. We do it in groups. So all the bishops of Region 7, that is Wisconsin, Illinois, Indiana, will be going together. Uh, and most of it is going to meetings at the different offices, the different congregations um, of the Vatican, and then also meeting with the Holy Father on Thursday, December 12th, as a group. I also have time to spend with our seminarians who are studying at the North American College. And really the, the point of the whole trip is for us as bishops to pray at the tombs of the apostles, uh, Peter and Paul. So we will have mass at all four of the major basilicas. Uh, we will pray together. And it certainly renews our union with the universal church and with the person of the Holy Father. So please know I take your intentions, your prayers, with me to Rome and we'll certainly pray for all of you, our priests, our deacons, our religious, our lay leaders, our lay faithful, um, at the tombs of the apostles. Please pray for us and please pray for our diocese. Uh, it's, it's a beautiful moment of recognizing and celebrating both the universality of the church, but also the particularity and the gifts and the blessings of our own diocese of Madison.